all, Harry. What's the news on Michael Dawson? Well, we're not sure yet. You know, it, it didn't look good. It didn't look like it looked like his ankle and his knee. It looked a pretty bad injury he's got there. Has he gone off to hospital? Or? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't good. I mean, is there a suggestion that could be it for the season? Or? Well, I mean, looking at his injury tonight, I mean, it would be a miracle, I would think, if he's not. But uh, you, you never know. But no, it, 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 it doesn't look too, didn't look good at all. I mean, it's a big blow for you and for, for the Yeah, for sure, for Michael. He's a great guy and uh, fantastic professional. You know, a big loss to us. You, you want Michael in your team and around the place, that's for sure. And Aaron Lennon? Yeah, he did a hamstring again. You know, he keeps tweaking hamstrings, Aaron, when he plays. And uh, so we've got to find a way of, I think, like lots of very, very quick players, sometimes they can do hamstrings. You know, Michael Owens had a, those little real flying machines and tend to uh, to get hamstrings occasionally. And he's had more than his share of them this year, unfortunately. You came through it tonight, but was that... Well, it was tough as I, ex I didn't expect anything different. I didn't come here tonight expecting this to be an easy. When people say to me, "Oh, you'll murder them," you know, they, they don't know what they're talking about, in my opinion, because you know, I, I, they're big, they're strong, they're great on set plays. Every corner is a problem. Every set play, we, we, we looked before the game, I and mean, we had three markers: Eunice Cabal, Michael Dawson, and um, Ryan Nelson, and then. They've got to stay put six in the box, and they're all six, uh, way over six foot. And our next three markers are, you know, five foot seven, five foot eight. So it was, and not headers of the ball. So we, it's, it's going to be a problem. Whatever, whatever football you want to play, every corner kick, you're holding your breath because if it drops in the wrong area, don't drop to one of your big ones to have a challenge. You know that they might. The, the chances are they're going to head it. And that early goal obviously gave them a massive boost. Didn't it? Yeah, they started well and got the penalty, and I haven't seen the penalty again. Whether it was a, you know, you'd know whether it was or wasn't. I haven't, got, I haven't seen a replay of it. And from where I was sitting, it's I couldn't. It's impossible to tell. When um, Michael went down, Joe went across to the fourth official quite a few times the first half. Seemed quite upset by some of the challenges. Were you... No, I didn't. Uh, I don't know. I didn't see what. I'll be honest with you. I'm, I'm not sitting on the fence. I didn't see what happened when Michael got injured. I haven't seen. I, w I will go downstairs and look at the replays, but I didn't. I didn't see what happened. I couldn't. Well, maybe Joe saw something. He didn't say nothing to me. I didn't see what happened. I didn't see. I, re I just saw Michael on the floor. I didn't see what happened when he. I didn't see the challenge or whether there was anything right or wrong with it at all. I couldn't comment on that. Two goals from Jermaine Defoe. Does that make him hard to leave out at Everton? On yeah, but you know, Louis Zaha has been scoring goals as well. You know, he's come in and scored. So, and uh, Manny gives us, you know, something different as well. So, we'll have to wait and see. But it's, it's good to see Jermaine back scoring. He's he's a good finisher, you know, and uh, he's a good player. <coughs> how, how do you view the cup and your priorities? Because you, you, you game away from Wembley, but obviously the, the league's so important. Well, we want Champions League football and we want to win the FA Cup. That's really where we're at. You know, both are, both are important. But the league is very important. We don't want to waste that opportunity we've given ourselves where we are because we deserve to be there this year. And we want to make sure we finish that job. And then, um, But we also want to go and win the FA Cup if we can. But it's not going to be easy. There's, some, there's a lot of tough teams in the FA Cup. Okay, Sahar, Sahar, right? Sahar. no, um, yeah, he should be okay the weekend. It's yeah, he should be fit. You know, he's had his knee drained, but no, he's had it done before, so it shouldn't be a problem for him. Any other knocks ahead of the weekend? No, I just one or two, a little bit tired, you know, but um, no real problem. Say Rafa, that was his first game for a while, and he he came through it okay in the end. So it was good for him. Nico Cranjar needed a game. We got a full game into him. Ryan Nelson got a game in tonight, which was good for his fitness as well. So that was that was a useful. When you look at the England strikers in the last squad, I mean, do you think Jermaine's kind of one of the inform guys around, particularly with um, Ben injured as well? Um, yeah, he must have a chance, mustn't he? I mean, you know, he's got. A, there's a shortage of top strikers in this country, isn't there? Let's be honest. I mean, uh, if there is a problem area, that is it. So, you know, as you say uh, Jermaine is up there with the best of them when he's, you know, when he's, he's sharp and on form and he's looking looking sharp at the moment. So, I'm delighted. He's a, again, you know, I've 
he's been with me all his career, more or less, you know, on and off from West Ham at 15. So I know what he can do, and uh, when he's in that type of form, he's a, he's a good player.